a very pleasant good good night my beloved brothers and sisters in christ and outside the body of christ well once again happy fire eric braxton to join you all in this short video from the republic of trinidad and tobago my beloved country in the in the west indies and the caribbean brothers and sisters as we as the whole world know and the whole world was in mourning a few days ago concerning that woman from England, that famous woman from England. You all know what I'm getting at, Queen Elizabeth. May God save the Queen. God save the Queen. Many people was in her side, on her side, in the quest, in the in the context that they love the Queen and they support the Queen and the British Empire. Many people was against the Queen, they did not like the Queen at all. And therefore, they bad talk the Queen and say all sorts of negative things concerning Queen Elizabeth, the Queen of England, and her family, the royal family of England. As the passing of the Queen, the Queen have died, I think it's 94 years, if my memory serves me right. Okay. Die, and world leaders gather all over the world and make the journey from the different countries to England for the funeral of the Queen. And all the world leaders uh, who could not make it to England, they show the respect to the Queen in their native country, right? And of course, from the day the Queen died. Till they bury her, the whole world was following the events that was taking place in England, on the newspapers, on the internet, on the radio, on the television. And many people come out and was ill speaking the Queen, not only the Queen, but the other queens and kings that lived before the Queen, that deal with the British Empire, from starting at the British Empire up to the time Queen Elizabeth died. And they say all sorts of things about the Queen, about the British Empire. Say, they say it is an evil empire, and they are a bunch of oppressors, and they, they support slavery of black people, and all sorts of things. They say about the, about the British Empire. And they say, they, and a lot of people say that the Queen, millions of people all over the world say who don't like the Queen. They say that she's an evil woman, she's an oppressor, and all these things they say. Even when the Queen was alive, many people say um, who the Queen was the head, who the Queen was, um, this country, who this who um who who England dominated now and the Queen was the head of the state. They say we had to get rid of the Queen. You understand? They don't want the Queen to represent them as the head of state. A lot of people in, the con in these country where the Queen is the head of state don't like the Queen and they want to get the um the head of the head the head of um, Queen Elizabeth as head of the head of state. So as Queen Elizabeth died, many people, they are saying all sorts of evil against the Queen. But do they have evidence to prove it? All nations have done wrong. And there is no perfect nation upon the earth. So even the British Empire, all of them did wrong. Yeah. All nations. All nations that done wrong. Yeah. I what about you, Eric Braxton? Do you you all you all people will ask, do you are you one of these people or you are you part of the crowd of these people from all over the world who is against the Queen? No, not at all. I support the Queen. God save the Queen of England. I was fortunate to see her in the flesh once when I was small, when she visited my country, Trinidad and Tobago. 
Yes, I want to support the queen. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, she, she have died. I wish I could have go England many years ago and happened to see her by the Buckingham Buckle Mall Palace or when she on the race track watching or in the race. She like horse racing uh, in the, the, when she goes to visit the place watching different horse. I wish I could I, I could uh, I could um, be there to see her watching the horse and be part of that activity. But unfortunately, when all these royal attack, 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 activity was taking place in England, I was down here. Now she die and gone. I never even get a chance to go up there to watch her, unfortunately. Well, that may be I cannot change reality about that. Having said that, but I want to make myself clear. You all see my hand is zero empty, yeah? zero stone. It has no stone in my hand. So me, I come out of pearl stone at the British Empire, neither against Queen Elizabeth, may God save the Queen and the royal family of England. British Charles, King Charles, and it's the family. So I, they see them on the other hand, all those who pelt in stone, and seeing the British Empire is our oppressive empire, and they support slavery, and there's a bunch of oppressors. I not joining that crowd or not? Mm -hmm. That crowd that they have stone and pelting against Queen Elizabeth and criticizing Queen Elizabeth and saying all sorts of evil against her and, the, and her family and the British Empire. I will not be joining that crowd. I want you all to know that. I will not be joining them in the confusion. In the bad talking against the Queen Elizabeth and the British Empire. I will not be joining them. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. And saying she was an evil woman. She was a wicked woman. And she supports slavery and all these things. Mm. A lot of things they say and they can't prove it, you know. Uh -huh. I, not be, I will not be joining them. Mm -hmm. Not be joining them, criticizing the queen. But now she have dead and gone. And seventy years she was on the throne. And seventy years on the throne. Mm -hmm. Seventy years on the throne. Queen Elizabeth. She reigned for a long time. Yes. I wish she was on the throne up to this day. I wish she was alive more than a hundred years. A matter of fact, I wish she. I wish she. she I wish she could have lived up to a hundred and twenty years. But I just my wish that would have to come to pass. Mm -hmm. That don't necessarily that wish will come to pass. I my personal wish, opinion. I wish she'd have lived up to 120 years. And she'd have be on the throne, but that have come to pass only 94. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Queen Elizabeth. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Queen Elizabeth. Yeah. Queen Elizabeth. Yeah. God save the Queen. God save the Queen of England. God save Queen Elizabeth II. God save the Queen. Yes, God save the Queen, man. Yes. Mia come out of bad talk, the Queen. The Queen was a good woman. That would mean say she, say she never said she make mistake. Even Abraham and Isaac and Jacob said I make mistake. Mm -hmm. Even King David and all. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because mankind is sinners. We're born in sin and shape iniquity. And that applied to all men except Jesus Christ. And that applied to Queen Elizabeth. Uh huh. So, so you see, I wonder them who pelt in stone against the British Empire and Queen Elizabeth now. I wonder if they know that. If they know that. Uh huh. If they read the Bible, they will know that. Uh -huh. They will know that. Yes, they will know that. So, near come out of hell, no stand against the British Empire. And the pell stone against Queen Elizabeth. Watch my hand clear. My hand is zero stone. No stone in my hand. And it will remain that way. Brothers and sisters, through the international community, through the international landscape, my hand will remain zero without stone. And I only felt it, no stone against Queen Elizabeth, the late, the late Queen Elizabeth. Because when she was alive, 
Queen Elizabeth, God save the Queen of England, Queen Elizabeth. I never, I Eric Braxton, this little Christian boy from the Caribbean, from the Republic of Trinidad, the, from the Republic of Trinidad and Tobago, at no time did I pelt any stone at her. Now she has dead. Will, will, I, will I fold my stone to start pelting stone and to join the crowd and start pelting stone again, sir? Not at all. When she was alive, my hand was zero without stone. Now she have died and she have gone. My hand continue to, continue to remain empty, zero stone. And ladies and gentlemen, it will remain that way. It will remain that way, ladies and gentlemen. And I'm not joining that crowd. I don't want to call them a bunch of hooligans. I don't want to do that. But that unruly crowd, yes. That unruly crowd, yes. That unruly crowd. Mm -hmm. A few man beings like myself who are pelting stone against it. Queen Elizabeth. Of course, I have pity for them. I have pity for them, and I have to pray for them, that God will forgive them. Yes, 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 because the sorts of things that they are saying about Queen Elizabeth and the British Empire and what she represent, oppression, and all these things. Even right in my own country, I will not call the name of the person. He, hear what he say. He say that she, is a, she, she, she was a symbol of oppression. I pity the guy. He's a con native country of my, he's a native person of my country. I pity him, I pity him. He does know better, and I pity him. Yeah, he's my brother, yeah, but I pity him. He does know better. I pity him, of course. Mm -hmm. I, want, I just hope one of these days he will see the light. But right now, he, he is blind to that. <laughs> I pity the guy, I pity the guy. In spite he's educated and black history and all these things, he's a historian now. Yeah, he's a black historian and black and and he involved in the black struggle with the Black Panthers and the Black Panther movements of America and Trinidad and Black Power and all these things, yeah. Black struggle and all these things for Africa and for the people black people in the Caribbean and wherever black people are against white people and oppression and all these things. And not yet know that is talk. Yeah, 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 but I pity him, I pity him, I pity him, <laughs> I pity the guy, <laughs> I really pity him, he does know better, <sighs> he does know better, but there's hope for him, eh? yeah, there's hope, there's hope for him, at one of these days you will recognize, you will recognize, you will recognize the truth, let us hope that they could, that they come, that you will recognize it, as in the shortest, Possible time, I've been said to all the December brothers and, brothers and sisters. And there are many people like you all over the world who are talking the same talk like you. Oh, the Queen is a symbol of oppression. What oppression, what? <laughs> what oppression, what? I'm not accepting that what you're saying about the Queen Elizabeth. I will accept that. No way at all. I'm not doing that at all. <laughs> I hear in the talk in the talk. But me are talking, they talk, they talk, and I talk, I talk and a different talk to what they say. You know? As they hear what they talk, I say, God bless the Queen. You will never hear he say, hear, hear he say that, God bless the Queen. But I am saying, Bla God bless the Queen. Mm -hmm. You see the difference? You see the difference, ladies and gentlemen? Yes. And I come out of belt, no stone against the British Empire. And against Queen Elizabeth. God save the Queen. Yes, God save the Queen of England, man. God save the Queen. Oh, yes, oh, yes, oh, yes, oh, yes. I wish she was still alive. I wish she'd live up to a hundred and more. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, man, Queen Elizabeth, man. God save the Queen. But unfortunately, that is a wish on my part. That wish hasn't come about. She had died at 94. Her husband, Prince Philip, had died at 99 years old. I think one year to a hundred. He lived a little longer than her. <laughs> I wish she'd live more longer than me, up to 110 or up uh, until 120. But I said, I just a wish on my part. It haven't fulfilled and hasn't come about. Well, I have to have the, I have to go along with reality. It haven't come about that. Come about how I wish, and I have to accept what took place. Having said that, 
ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls all over the world. God save the Queen of England, and she will dearly be missed. Queen Elizabeth will dearly be missed all over the world. Yes, she will be missed. She will be missed. She will be dearly be missed. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. She will be missed. She will be missed. She will really be missed, ladies and gentlemen. Mm. She will really be missed. Queen Elizabeth, ma'am. She will dearly be missed. Dearly be missed. Mm -hmm. Dearly be missed. Mm -hmm. And all these people in England who didn't like the Queen. <laughs> oh Lord, may God forgive them. And all the people in <laughs> oh, New Zealand and Australia. New Zealand, Australia. And Canada who didn't like the Queen. May God forgive them. <laughs> Bye. And all the colonies that obtained independence from Britain. And all who the Queen is still the head of state. And she have a governor general representing her who don't like the queen, may God forgive them. Oh boy. You see, me come out to condemn. Me condemn to write, write them off. And me condemn, come to condemn them. All I say is God have mercy upon them and forgive all of them. That's all I say in any video. That's all I'm saying in the video. Mm -hmm. That's all I'm saying in the video, ladies and gentlemen. But in this video, I have much to talk about the Queen, or no? Queen Elizabeth. Yeah, since she, since she had died, this is my first video I'm recording to give my take on that. But it have more other videos to come where I'll be dealing with the Queen Elizabeth, the late Queen Elizabeth of England. Of course, this will not be the last of this talk. But I have to chat with you all and tell you a lot of things about Queen Elizabeth. And I tend to do a little research <laughs> about Queen Elizabeth. And look back at her life now, coming up before she died. Mm -hmm. Yes, when she was much younger now, coming up. Yeah, in other words, her 70 years rule on the throne. I had to do a little research on that. So I have quite a lot of uh, chat to chat with you all about the late Queen Elizabeth. Yes, 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 yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, 70 years on the throne, that history. Can cannot contain in a little twenty minutes video. Uh huh. So I have much to talk about to, to you all about yeah, that Queen Elizabeth of England, that wonderful woman, Queen Elizabeth. May God save the Queen. That wonderful woman of England, Queen Elizabeth. Yes, Queen Elizabeth, man. And of course, her husband, Prince Philip, and her children. Yes, yes, I have much to talk about them, ladies and gentlemen. Much to talk about them. Mm -hmm. Much to talk about them, the British Empire. By the way, before I end the video, I just want you to, to know, well, I will deal with that too. They are Ephraim. I know you all will know who is Ephraim. Well, they are Ephraim. But I will give you all a little information concerning that in other videos to come. Yes, they are Ephraim. Mm-hmm. Yes, 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 yes. Mm-hmm. That Ephraim that is mentioned in the Bible, that's them. Who believe it or not? Whether you all say except that is old talk and that is not true what you're saying, Braxton. Or is it proof? That's because a white man hamstrung say that you fall in here and saying that. That's because Dr. Gene Scott that the next white man who who die and go and say that you following them and saying the same thing. I know they were saying it's true, and I tend to say what they're saying, because what they're saying is true. Yeah, England is Ephraim. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. But I'll give a little in-depth in concerning who is Ephraim, dealing with that. Mm -hmm. So, brothers and sisters, this will not be the end about the death at the end of Queen Elizabeth, that wonderful woman who was on the throne for 70 years. Huh, man, 70 years, that's a lot of history. So you know, all you know, that have a, a lot of talking to talk about Queen Elizabeth, of course. <laughs> that wonderful woman who have lived and died, Queen Elizabeth, who have traveled the world and meet with kings and prince and prime ministers and, and leaders, all the leaders of the earth, prince, prime ministers, president, emperors, governors. Mm -hmm. 
not only live in England and meeting them all over the world, they come into England to see her. And after all, to top it off, she was the head of the Commonwealth. <laughs> Queen Elizabeth, the head of the Commonwealth. Yes. When you hear the Commonwealth meet at Wada in South Africa, the Queen is there to open, open the meeting before the leaders got, when they get up to discuss the matters. The Queen are there. Yeah, to address them. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. and, in, and in England, the new term, when they, when they elect the new Prime Minister, the Queen is there in the, in the Parliament to address the Prime Minister, the opening of Parliament, to address the, 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 the House of Commons, to address the, the Labour Party, the Labour Party, and the next party. The two party of England, the Labour and the next party, but the House of Commons, she's there to address, address them. And you, how she, you hear what she, how she does call them? Those on the Labour side and those on the government side. Labour thing is opposition, or who, who is opposition, or who is in the government? You hear how she does address them? All of them? All of you, you, all of you all here are my ministers. And the speaker too, everybody in the house. All of all is my ministers. And hear what she does say. All of all is, is you all are my government. Uh -huh. She's the head of the government. She's head of state of England. And hear what the queen has just said. All of you all are my ministers. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All of you all are my ministers. Mm -hmm. And the Prime Minister, all of, all of them is she ministers. Uh -huh. She's the head of state. Uh -huh. How did they know that? Uh -huh. That old lady, all they watching, if she, if she, look, she can walk. Yeah, with the white gloves in she hand and the hat and she little person. Yeah. And she inspecting the guard and all the soldiers and them. And she, she actually walk in stick. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And all them soldiers are just stand up attention to she, yeah? Yeah, she's the head of state. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All of them like to see she in a wheelchair. Mm -hmm. I'm glad she didn't end up the... I'm glad she was able to walk with a nice hat, she nice gloves, the little stick to balance she and to walk. Mm -hmm. And every guard stand up attention. Mm -hmm. Respect the guards, the troops, the soldiers. <laughs> because she's just commander of the army. Yeah, that old lady, all the watching the whole the thing she is. She's the head of state. She's the commander in chief of the army of England. All they didn't know that. Uh -huh. Yeah, that woman, all the west watching the. Uh -huh. Don't she look like a old woman? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the thing, all the kick she aside. Mm -hmm. She's commander in chief of the army. I see all of them have to salute to her. Uh-huh. I want all of you to know that. I want all of you to know that. Mm -hmm. I know she is specking all the guards. She in civilian wear. Uh -huh. with, a, with a nice dress, neat and pressed and nice, with she pulls. Mm -hmm. all, you all you think is only, all you think, all you think is only civilian clothes she could have. She has military clothes to put on to. Uh-huh, all you know that. All you know that. But she doesn't wear the military clothes all the time. She's, a, she's more wear civilian clothes, but sometimes you see she's in military uniform with all the medals and things because she's at a state. Uh huh. On the sit down on the throne. Yes, at least she's so, but she has some pictures with that. With full military on and sit down on the throne. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's a military royal family. All the watch her She's the head of state. Oh, but all they don't see she so all the time. Mm -hmm. She likes to wear she nice dress. She nice highly shoes, nice hat and gloves. A civilian, looking like an ordinary woman. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Expect she to put on a military uniform all the time. Eh? With medals and all the things. Eh? Eh? She hardly put on that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. God save the queen. God save the Queen of England. Oh yes, I wish she was. I wish she was still alive after a hundred years. One. Mm -hmm. God save the Queen. 
what if the Queen of England, ma'am? Mm -hmm. And all the ambassadors from all the nations of the earth, when they come to England, is she there to go to, to present the peace, to present the, peace, the credentials? Who do you think they're going to the Prime Minister? Is the Queen Elizabeth there to go to the head of state? Mm -hmm. I want you all to know that. Yeah. And every country they go, they have to roll out what? A red carpet for her because she's the head of state. Visiting our next country. Uh huh. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yes. 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 Queen Elizabeth, man. God save the queen. God save the queen of England. Yes. 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 Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Well, what I tell you, all the history is there for all to see. In England, don't study it all, you will see it for yourself. You just make up talk, I tell you, all you're giving all you. Uh -huh. You know, no make up talk now. Uh huh. Uh -huh. God save the Queen, man. God save the Queen. <laughs> and all the ambassadors that come to her, all the, con all the, all the ambassadors that come, to, that come to Queen Elizabeth to present the potential. You think they're all like she? These young fellas, young, young boy, young, young men and young women, who the government have appointed other countries, and they're going to England to present the presidential to the Queen. She, they're coming to our old old lady sitting on the, they're coming to, they're coming in back the palace to see her old old woman, and they have to present the queen, they present the the presidential credential to her. She's the head of state. She's a mother to all of them. There's like little children coming to she. That's why you see all you see the queen. Let me say like the ambassador of France coming up to take his five years appoint um five years assignment in the in the French embassy in England because the French ambassador his five years term, he going back to the next country. So the, the president of France appoint a new ambassador to England. He arrived in England, he's going to present his presidential to the queen. He's only He's only 50 years old. The, woman, the queen is 90 years old. He come into a old woman. She, he, when, he, when she come, when he come and he see the old woman, he already know she's a old woman. When she come, when he walk in the room to present his credential to he, Queen Elizabeth seen he's like a little 10 years old child come into he. She's done 90 years. She's like a mother to he. When she come, when he come and present the present, Prudential to the Queen. You see the Queen is sit down on your royal chair and she chatting with him and telling him this, telling him that, you're five years, you know, such a five years, so and so and so, and she teaching him and guiding him and all these things. Yeah. Because she's a she's like a mother to he and he and he is like a little child to her. Uh-huh. I want you all to know that. I want you all to know that. God save the Queen of England. Mm -hmm. Queen Elizabeth, man. God save the Queen. Mm -hmm. I want you all to know that. Yeah, I want you all to know that. Mm -hmm. The guy come out of Pellstone and Queen Elizabeth. All right. I'm not doing that at all. Mm -hmm. I'm not doing that at all, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, I'm not doing that at all. I want you all to know that. I want all and sundry to know that. Mm -hmm. In Queen's told that Queen Elizabeth. Mm -hmm. Only come to only wait until the glad Queen Elizabeth there. The, a lot of them, many of them, the handful of stone out, all the pelting stone left, right, and center. A Queen Elizabeth criticizing and criticizing the British Empire and say, speaking all ill of evil and and manner of evil and wickedness against Queen Elizabeth and the British Empire. And the British Empire. May God forgive them. Mm -hmm. Yes, 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 yes. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's all. They're speaking all sorts of evil against Queen Elizabeth, ladies and gentlemen. All sorts of evil that are speaking against Queen Elizabeth. May God, um, may God help them. May God help them. And may God forgive them. For all the, for all the ill thing, for all the evil they're speaking against Queen Elizabeth, may God save the Queen of England. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh.
<laughs> well, brothers and sisters, I will end the video end the video on this note. As I said, this will not be the last of this talk concerning Queen Elizabeth. I have much video to record to present to you all concerning Queen Elizabeth, the late Queen Elizabeth. In the next, in, 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 in the, of the late Queen Elizabeth, of the late Queen Elizabeth, of the late Queen Elizabeth, ladies and gentlemen. Oh boy, I wish she could have been alive today, but um, but she had died. Well, you have to accept that. You have to accept that, ladies and gentlemen. You have to accept that. Queen Elizabeth was a good woman. And she was no wicked, she was no wicked woman or no evil woman. And she was no op symbol of no oppression to anyone. I want the world to know that. I want the world to know that. And I end the video on that note. I end the video on that note. I want the world to know that. Mm -hmm. She was a good woman to one and all. Yes, to one and all, ladies and gentlemen. No other name, but in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, name and name. And shalom, peace. See you all in the next video So, Bye-bye, my friends. We will continue on, on this talk about the 70 years of reign of our Queen, the late Queen Elizabeth on the throne of the British Empire. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. We'll continue on that, ladies and gentlemen, in other videos to come. Bye-bye. Shalom, peace. See you all in the next video soon. Bye-bye, my friends.